We are the Hutchinson family from the UK and we are currently on an epic three month tour of China. We started our journey in Guangzhou and we've seen the bright lights, the wonderful people and the amazing food. But in this video, we see the real China. Hello and welcome to the video. Today we are in Foshan. It's about one hour away from Guangzhou and we have come to Zichao Mountain. Let's go see what it's got to offer. Come on. We're really lucky that we chose to buy the tickets for the car to get up there because we've just found out the walk all the way up to the top of the mountain is going to take us over an hour but it's only a couple of minutes in the buggy so I'm really glad we bought those tickets. Can you see that sound for me? Well, hey, this is going to be a little bit easier than walking up there. Chris is going to be jogging behind, he's behind the camera right now. <laughs> is he going to be able to keep up? <laughs> I'm definitely not going to be jogging behind, I'm going to get in this luxury vehicle. So we've made it to the top of the mountain and wow it is bright up here that is much better wow what a place there's a lot of people here i think there's a full school tour here but yeah we made it to the top it looks really really special here incredible she's sitting down and looking down across the mountain I cannot wait to get there and see the view that she's looking down upon just check out this wall it's got so many sculptures on it it's amazing now let's go see Quan Yen We've now joined the school trip. We're part of the gang. We've been swamped up. Yeah. It's a big tour. Hello, 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 hello. Yeah. So it's really incredible. We've not really got to the top as of yet, but the architecture as you walk around is incredible. It's all made out of marble. There's so many carvings in the marble and the rooftops of each temple are just very, very interesting. So even the walk up there to the top, up to Kuan Yin, is, has been extremely interesting. And the view behind me with the city is phenomenal we have chosen a very very good day to come here the weather is absolutely incredible the sun is out it's not too hot it's not really really windy it is just right wow we have made it to the top and the view is stunning. She's sat there, Kuan Yin, on top of the mountain, looking down on the city, and it really is special. What a sight to see. We're finally here. The view in that direction is incredible of the city. The view behind us is incredible. I do think there are a few more stairs to get right to the foot of her, but the view of her is incredible from just here. We made it to the top. She looks so amazing and so big, and I can see the fish. We made it. We made wow, it. Wow, what a sight. Incredible. Woo! Wow, that was such an incredible experience. We are now heading off for some food because I'm absolutely starving. I wonder what is going to be in store for lunch. I'm quite excited. So now we've come for some food at Wang Mei Sing in Foshan. 
and we've just got a private room it looks really really nice um, but the difference is here is there isn't any singular menus so the menu is right here on this giant wall so if you've got a bad eyesight it's really good because you can literally see what everything is in giant picture form so you just pick and choose what you're eating so that's what we're doing right now we're ordering some dishes and then we're going to try some foods this lady here is recommending um, some local dishes so we're excited to try one of them I'm told includes pigeon which I'm unsure because we've never had pigeon before but we're going to give it a go we've just been shown that in Guangdong province that this is a tradition that you actually wash your own stuff so I've got boiling water in here I didn't know if I was meant to drink it but no you wash so you rinse around the glass and then we're going to put it in the bowl wash the chopsticks with this boiling water then pour it into trying to get the edges of the bowl to make sure that it's all clean and there we go wow you learn something new every day oh good job okay so some of the food has arrived and it looks really really nice and also the really kind lady who is serving us has gifted us some soup and some uh, fried milk sort of dessert treats that I think the girls are going to try but I'm going to give the soup a go first apparently there might be a little surprise in there um, that we wouldn't usually find in soup and I'm going to have a little look now it smells good it smells really really good and I can see the surprise we have a chicken foot right there I think it must be chicken feet soup or chicken foot soup I don't know but we're gonna give it a go it does smell good and apparently um, they cooked this for five hours so a lot of effort has gone into this soup a lot of flavorings some Chinese herbal medicine as well It tastes really, really good. It tastes really good. Apparently, it's also very healthy, so I better eat all this. So I'm gonna try like these fried milky sticks here. So let's give this a go. Mmm. So we are going to try some pigeon today as well. The pigeon has arrived. It's on the table, on display. I'm gonna go for a chicken wing, not a chicken wing, a pigeon wing. So there we go, here it is. Mm. It literally just tastes like chicken. Tastes like chicken. Saltier than chicken, you can tell. Okay, so I'm going to try something um, that looks a little bit different. It's pork uh, that's been cooked inside of a pepper. It looks really interesting on the menu. Can we see that there? So it's pork inside the pepper. It looks very interesting. Wow. Okay. I think that might be a chili pepper because it's got a nice kick to it, it's very spicy. The pork tastes really, really nice. Whatever this dish is called, um, it's one worth trying. That's really, really nice, really nice. So we're so very full after this amazing food here, but this very kind lady keeps bringing us more food. She's been very kind and very nice. I think she's just brought some pineapple, so the girls are going to try it, but we're so full. So we have some pineapple cake, I think. I'm not sure if it's dry pineapple or pineapple cake, so I'm going to try it. Oh, it sounds crunchy. Oh, so hot. Is it hot? <laughs> it's really hot, but it's super nice. There's like um, pineapple inside and then this crusty thing on the top. I think it's just cooked pineapple on the top. That's why it's so crunchy. It was really nice. 
pineapple crunchy cake. I try. Oh wow. I think it's fried pineapple. It is hot, but that's a really nice treat. Wow, that was fantastic food. We can't thank Wang Mei Xin enough for their hospitality and everybody visiting Foshan must come here. It thank was you. absolutely thank you. delicious. Really, really good. We really enjoyed it. Bye. Thank you. Bye bye everyone. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. Yes, yeah. We've eaten at the restaurant and they wanted to gift us these traditional cake things that are local to this area that we have visited. So this is really interesting. I cannot wait to try these. We have had a fantastic day and now we are back where we started our journey here in Guangzhou on Beijing Road. One of our favourite spots. It's so lively, there's so many people about and all the action happens here. So, we want to say a big thank you to everybody who's followed our journey so far. We've had an incredible time here in Guangzhou. The welcome has been fantastic and we have loved everything that we have done all the foods we have eaten it has been an excellent trip so far if you've enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button and we will see you in our next location here in china bye